Hi and good day everyone. I am Hasia Muhammad and my team members are Dr. Norziana and Puan Ernie Arniza. So the title of our project is All-in-One Computing Project Management Platform known as AIO CPM Platform. So before we proceed to the presentation, let me uh, provide you the overview of, of the presentation. The first one is introduction. Literature review, methodology, result and discussion, conclusion and recommendation. So for the introduction, let me introduce you what is AIO CPM platform. Okay, so it is an all-in-one platform designed to manage every aspect of computing project management, teaching and learning efforts. Okay, students provided teaching materials such as slide and video for their basic learning process. And on top of that, um, teaching and learning uh, materials such as the mind mapping, video from other resources, experience sharing from the alumni, gamification that focus on M MCQ questions that uh, we provide from the previous final exam and the subjective questions. So all of the materials provided in this platform focus to assist students in preparing for their assessment as well as for for them to have more uh, understanding regarding the project. So these are the problem statements. Okay, access to the provided uh, learning management uh, system sometimes unstable and limited section provided to upload teaching material and assessment material. The current provided platform requires students to log in and sometimes material and assessment provided are limited. Okay. The objective of our project, the first one, to identify problems associated to teaching and learning computing project management. Second one, to streamline the computing project management teaching and learning effort. And the third one, to test the materials provided in terms of content, completeness, quality, and navigation. So in terms of practicality, we provide a single platform for teaching and learning materials. Materials provided to assist students in preparing for their final assessment. Okay. So, designed to cater objective and subjective questions that related to the final assessment concept. Okay. The usefulness of AI, AIO CPM platform is minimize the time, minimize the effort, make it easier to assess, create more collaborative environment, and optimize user experience to boost teaching and learning experience. Okay, in terms of novelty, for the usability, it's a platform that's significantly higher than having students to bounce back, to bounce from one platform to another platform. Accessibility, it can be accessed anywhere, anytime, and if they get used to it, it can be faster for them to uh, navigate through the content, and it is compatible to all kind of devices. Okay, these are the statement of the all in one CPM platform, instead of preparing a single content for a topic, AIO CPM platform provides a comprehensive computing project management materials within a single access in a platform. Okay, for the literature review, in terms of teaching and learning creativity, uh, Refka, Refka uh, Makram 2021 and Emini Yes Pandev 2021 mentioned that creativity and uh, teaching and learning for online teaching and learning are needed. Okay, the need of col collaborative tools in teaching and learning, okay, mentioned by uh, Faridatul Akma in 2017. Okay, in terms of the use of Padlet, students respond positively in using Padlet for teaching and learning process, okay, mentioned by Khaira Anwar in 2009, and Fitra Aulia in 2021 mentioned that Padlet have the potential to create environment to encourage students in their learning process. Okay, now, we move on to the methodology. Okay, so these are the methodology used for the development of our AIO CPM platform. Okay, the first one, requirement analysis. The second one, design. The third one, development. The fourth one, testing. The fifth one, uh, deployment. And uh, the sixth is the feedback. Okay, in terms of design, development, and testing, we cater all of this important element for uh, for the uh, platform, for the content as well. Okay, so we 
consider, we take into consideration the relevance or longevity, content accuracy, the clarity, production quality, accessibility, interactivity and licensing of our uh, material provided in Padlet platform. Okay, so these are the output of uh, from the process of the design, deployment and testing. So we provide the range of cognitive demand where uh, from number one until number eight support the knowledge comprehension and application. Okay, number nine until number twelve, the quizlet, quizzer, sample, uh, MCQ and uh, short structured question you cater for the application, analytical synthesis and evaluation. So we take exam um, we get the rubric from the um, online educational uh, resource okay online educational resources so we cater all of the element okay the second one okay um, regarding the opportunity for student to test their learning we provide the um, assessment type for the quizzes uh, mcq as well as the short structured questions and we promote active learning class participation where we provide the telegram link uh, if they click the link it will go to our uh, telegram channel okay in terms of the multiple modalities approach okay mix of instructional approaches okay information accurate and provide material for clear and logical manner okay in terms of uh, target exploration of the course content okay for the cost um, accuracy, we provide a thorough exploration of the cost content. Okay, in terms of clarity, we provide the content understandable and present the main idea. Okay, we also provide um, clarity in terms of the uh, headings, no spelling error, and content present the main idea. In terms of the production quality, we look at in terms of uh, easy to navigate, promote learning content, clear and understandable. Okay, we also provide high quality audio and video resources. Okay, we provide the suggestion uh, for ways to use the material. So we have the clear instruction. We provide the material like, comprehensive and easy to understand. Okay, uh, this is the example of the video and audio. We provide the transcript because we link it to the... Uh, YouTube. Okay, we have the description for the uh, graphic provided. Okay, we also um, set this uh, pilot to public so it can uh, accessible accessible by the public. Okay, um, we prov description included for the graphic provided. Okay, for the interactivity, we well designed, easy to use. Okay, uh, responsive and interactive. Okay, uh, this are the example of the uh, our Telegram channel. Okay, student can click from the Padlet and will go to our Telegram channel, and uh, student can interact with the uh, instructor. Okay, so these are the feedback um, for the student uh, give their feedback when they use our uh, Padlet. Okay, these are the result of the student feedback. And in terms of licensing, we register this in um, we register this okay uh, under the creative content. Okay, so this is the overall of our all-in-one computing project management platform. Okay, in terms of testing, we conduct testing based on the seven elements provided. Okay, in terms of content. Um, quality, navigation, and overall. Okay, so as for result and discussion, so in terms of design, we design based on the seven elements provided, as well as the development, we go detail for each of the elements, and we also test based on this. Okay, so for conclusion, um, we stated the problem segment, the objective, the methodology, and the outcome of our um, research. Okay, so the development are completed, stated objective are achieved, and uh, for the recommendation, this platform can be used for other uh, courses or suitable content, and it's not 
only focus on teaching and learning. Okay, so with that, thank you. Assalamualaikum.